State. And welcome to the 2 p.m. update here at TFNN with me, David White. What do we have? Well, the Fed minutes are out. I haven't seen a big move here. Let's take a look. Yeah, gold's moving a little bit. Let's see what else is happening here. Eh. Eh. 4,012, not much of a movement. Uh, not much up, not much down. Pretty much where we were before uh, the uh, announcement. So it'll take a little while to go through uh, all that. But at the moment, uh, not an instant reaction that I can see. Uh, other things going on, uh, this morning we had a little bit of rain with the uh, Fed president, uh, James Bullard, coming out and saying that he wanted uh, the rates uh, maybe not eventually higher than what they were projecting, which is about 5.5%, but uh, getting there a little bit further or faster. So looking about that, uh, looking at that, Everybody kind of eh, had a little bit of a uh, of a uh, down move this morning uh, on Bullard's discussion. Uh, as we go uh, into the rest of the week, uh, we'll see what happens when they get done reading the whole thing. Uh, tonight after the bell, we've got uh, T.J. Maxx and Baidu. Uh, oh, no, excuse me. That's uh, that was today. Um Thursday morning, we have Alibaba and Moderna in the morning. Uh, and then Thursday night, we have uh, Square, uh, Bookings.com, Intuit, Melee, and Autodesk Thursday night. So we're going to probably, uh, you know, we'll probably see a lot of people try to make a lot more out of the minutes uh, than was there. I, my guess is by the time that we close today, they'll forget what happened at 2 o'clock and we'll be back to whether or not earnings are actually, uh, you know, something that we should uh, really be leaning on. As far as the big movers out there, uh, the big loser of the day is Keysight. It's uh, down about 13%. A uh, symbol on that is Keys. The big winner uh, is Pan W, P A N W, up about 12%. We'll be back in just a minute. The reality is that navigating financial markets can be risky.